start with a basic takeoff. Hold the throttle all the way down to pick up speed, and pull back on the stick to take off. You can retract your landing gear once you're a safe distance above the ground. Congratulations, pilot! You are now airborne. Now, navigate through those checkpoints marked on your radar, and we can move on to the next lesson. That was a good start! Well done! Now I'm going to have you attempt a safe landing on the runway. altitude gradually so you're just above the runway as you approach. Be sure to deploy the landing gear before you reach the runway. Start to decelerate while you're still in the air, but be careful not to stall the engine. Executed like a pro! Now let's get the plane off the runway. Taxi over to the marked area and come to a complete stop. That was an excellent landing. Very well done.
When I give you the signal, I want you to try to hold a knife edge with your plane. Okay, perform a knife edge. Perfect. Now hold that position. Don't forget to use your rudders to maintain altitude. Level out the plane. Good. Let's see if you can do the same thing on the other side. On my mark, roll your plane over to the opposite side and hold the position. Okay, perform a knife edge on the other side. Level out the plane. I think you could have done a little better out there, but there's always next time. This obstacle course is designed to teach you how to get better I want you to use everything you've learned so far to navigate this course as fast as you can. Watch your altitude, though. This is really a test of how low you can go and how well you can maneuver the plane. Excellent job! I couldn't have done it much better myself. <laughs>
Take off and head for the marker at the end of the runway. Some pilots find these moves particularly tricky, so it might take you a few tries. Always make sure your plane is straightened out before you attempt an inside loop. On my mark, pull back hard on the flight stick and hold it. Okay, perform an inside loop. Get ready to level out the plane when you're near the end of the loop. That wasn't too bad for a rookie. Let's try it again, just like before. Steady the plane first, wait for my signal, and then pull back hard on the flight stick. Okay, perform an inside loop. Get ready to level out the plane when you're near the end of the loop. Now we're talking. You're doing good so far. I think we can squeeze in one more stunt. We'll combine the inside loop with the barrel roll to perform a roll off the top. Start with an inside loop, but only go halfway. When you're fully inverted, then roll the plane over. Now, when I give you the go-ahead, yank the flight stick back as hard as you can. Ready? Perform a roll off the top. Now, roll the plane right side up. Not bad! You did all right out there! in the plane, we're going to put you in a helicopter. Let's go on a short tour of the city, and we'll see how well you handle the chopper. Follow the marked course, and remember, I'm looking for maneuverability, but also speed.
lesson, but with a real emphasis on speed. Skydiving onto a moving. The drop zone is on the back 
of a moving truck. So take your time maneuvering with your parachute. It's better to pull your chute early than late. It will give you more time to track the target and try to match its speed. seeing some improvement. that one. a lot of progress. 